over sometimes. Go backwards roll. And I'll end up on this side. And then now we pass the guard. Right? Sometimes. Sometimes I'll flip him and let him go. And sometimes I'll backward roll. And here. Keep, keep the leg. Sweep. He tries to come on top. Look at the arm. See this arm? It's caught. As we both look, appear to be doing the same thing. And then now we have good control. Okay? So just underhook the leg. It's such so natural. Underhook the leg. And you have an arm drag, and you have a leg. And now you just kick. Push the mat. Kick as you kick. Bridge. Let go of the leg and come on top. Okay? Goes to your shoulder. He attempts to sweep you, but you're a great base. He starts to lift, 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 and then you base. And he goes, oh, thank you for the leg. Sweeps you over, and he rolls on top. Good. He, he kind of did a little bit of both. It was almost like he was doing the one with the bridge, but then you back with both. That's fine. Okay, your turn. See, you don't have to get up. You just go right away. Don't waste time. Don't waste time. And the guy's here, and he's like this. So when you start to stay with the right arm? Yeah, yeah, exactly. Yeah. Now look at the control you have. Right. Now you're going to take me over this shoulder. You landed like this. Why not put this knee down? So when this knee is down, he has less mobility. Even if this knee starts to creep in, like I'm like pressuring, I'm like controlling the guy. The guy wants to get the half guard. It's hard for him, you know? Now I can start passing. But if you come back into this position and you take your, your knee and say, I did have this, and I went like this, oh man, this guy's gonna play guard now. You know, like, even if, even if, uh, I, like he doesn't sweep me, he grabs my ankle, he recovers his hips, just a more standard square. Now look, we're fighting now. Now he gets to play all of his programmed moves. He's been taught. He gets to go, oh, I get to do my sweeps. I can do my butterfly guard, I can play Valhiva, scissor sweep, just basic stuff. We want to take all that away. So the moment that you sweep him, staple, staple the leg. Do it again. Underhook. Now this time. Right knee down. Down. Yeah. Now look at the control. He's framing it and now you pass. Good. Look for underhooks, look for control points. Um, I don't like when you pass and you just give up underhook. Try to get the underhook. If you don't have the underhook, go to the doorstop. Do you know what I'm talking about? Yeah. Go to the doorstop. A couple more guys. Keep, keep digesting it. You got resist. Yeah. Start your butterfly sweep. Say thanks for the leg. Good. Don't leave your arm between the legs. Good. Leaving, leaving the arm between the legs could lead towards him bumping over your head, getting you trapped in a triangle, trapped in a triangle, you know? So, so once you sweep him on that one, just let his leg go and just come on top if you're gonna just bridge and turn over. Come on. To the side, and now he's like, oh, thanks for the leg. Nice, that's good. That's all right. That was nice. I know you want to make it better, so just if yeah. you're gonna backward roll with him, backward roll with him. Like just keep everything in the same position. Do it again. Do it again. I know you can get this. You're gonna get it. You kind of, you like the backward roll, so let's do the backward roll. Yes, better. But but your butterfly hook yeah. should still be there. So your right foot. Like it's your right foot. No, right. it's your right foot. Your right foot, and that way you have them stapled. Okay. And then here, move out of And now, when you're on top, you, you're probably gonna have the legs still. Yeah. And you're gonna be smashing them like a cradle. Mm -hmm. You know, I could take it like a cradle. It, no, no, under his head with your right hand. And now you're like this. Now you can pass easily. You can move the leg through. Don't need his balls. You can go that way too. Yeah. Both ways are fine. Okay. Or you could just cradle. Yeah. Back step. Try one more time. Slow it down. And then notice where the butterfly hook is. Try it again. It's your right foot. Ready? So you go through. You're, you're going to underhook with the right leg. 
or with your left arm on his, his right leg, and now you still have a butterfly there. Beautiful! So now try to move right as you smash him. See that? Now, you, like, where are you gonna go? You move right. Yeah, you see? And now you just go ahead and pass. Just pass, exactly. You see the control? That's what I'm talking about. Don't let that bottom guy get his game going. He doesn't get a chance. We don't give chances. Like, man, I want, I could have checkmated you, bro, but I didn't see it. I didn't see the checkmate. You know, you got to know it's mate in five. And then the guy, the game is locked. The best players, the grandmasters are watching your chess game, and they're going, dude, he had him. And he let him out for control of the position, not realizing you got checkmate, you know. Let's go. 